Good afternoon, St. Cloud High School. My name is Brennan Johnson, and I'm here to bring you your afternoon announcements. Today, as always, we're going to get started with our general announcements. Attention all students. Please check your computer for the secure testing icon on the bottom left of your screen when you power up your computer and before you log in. If you do not have this icon, please see our tech specialist in 8-105 during lunch prior to March 31st. This is very important for upcoming testing. To check for this icon, log out of your computer first, then return to the login screen. If you do not have that icon, we cannot do testing, and then you will be forced to do other remake testings. Either way, you're going to have to have that icon on your screen, so make sure it's there as soon as possible. Also, please ensure computers are in their cases at all times to help decrease the likelihood of damage. Damages to computers is your financial responsibility, so you will be forced to repay that debt or you may not be able to graduate. And finally, please see the tech specialist during lunch only. They are there every day. And in case any of you are unaware, both students and teachers alike, we have our first author visit coming up next week. Former Bulldog Alexis Castellanos, and I'm sure I'm still saying that wrong, will be here on Monday to talk about her novel, Isla to Island. To get an invitation to this exclusive event, be one of the first 50 students to read Isla to Island and log it on Beanstack. We also have March Madness going on where the students that log the most minutes will earn prizes. To find out more information, talk to your English teacher or Ms. Perez in the Media Center. And before we move on to our sports news, as always, we have our weather news. Now, over the weekend, it looks like it's going to be just rising up and completely dissipating that cold front that we had earlier on in the week. Now, during this um, weekend, it looks like it's going to be jumping into the 90s. And then by the time we come back Monday, it will be high of 93 with a low of 66, which will probably only last in about 3 a.m., in the morning so don't expect it to be cold almost at all make sure you're wearing something light so you do not overheat and now let's kick it on over to our sports news the boys lacrosse team won its second consecutive game last night 12 to 2 over university they will play at melbourne tonight girls start at 5 30 p.m followed by the boys at 7 p.m good job guys and the boys volleyball team cruised to a 3 to 0 victory over forest lake academy last night as well they host a tournament tomorrow starting at 9 a.m. Again, good job. And the flag football crews to a 20-0 victory last night against East River. They will host Toho tonight at 7 p.m. And the softball team will play tonight at Satellite. First pitch will be at 6 p.m. Good job, all of you wonderful Bulldogs. Keep it up. And sadly, that's all we have for today's afternoon announcements, Bulldogs. So everyone, please, as always, have a fantastic Bulldog Day and a great weekend.